IMO class 5 set C everyday mathematics. Everyday mathematics question number 36. Sahil took 1 hour 15 minutes to complete a project. He finished the project at 2.55 p.m. At what time did he start doing his project? Time taken to complete the project is equal to 1 hour 15 minutes. He finished the project at 2.55 p.m. In order to find when he started doing the project, we have to subtract the total time from the time he finished, which is equal to 1.40 p.m. Everyday mathematics question number 37. 58 people can travel in one bus. How many buses will it will be needed for 1624 people to go on a trip? Number of people in one bus is equal to 58. Number of buses needed for 1624 people is equal to 28. Everyday mathematics question number 38. The Children of Housing Society raised a fund of 40,000 rupees for helping the flood victims in two states. They have decided to give 2 by 5 of the money collected to state A and rest of the money to state B. How much money did they give state B? Total money they collected is equal to 40,000 rupees. 2 by 5 of the total money collected is equal to 16,000. That is A state. Amount of money given to state B is equal to total money collected minus amount of rupees given to state A. State B is equal to 24,000 rupees. Everyday mathematics question number 39. The total runs scored by three players P, Q and R in a year are given in Roman numbers respectively. Who among the following scored maximum runs in a year? Total runs scored by P is equal to 966, Q 1965, R 1597. So the maximum number of runs scored in a year is by Q. Everyday mathematics question number 40. Akshit collected 90,528 stickers. He distributed the stickers equally among his 12 friends. How many stickers did each friend get? Number of stickers each one got is equal to total stickers divided by number of friends, which is equal to 7,544. Everyday mathematics question number 41. Nidhi walks every day around a rectangular park whose side measured 60 meter and 38 meter. How much does she walk in a day if she takes 5 rounds around the park? Perimeter of the park is equal to 196 meter. Given she takes 5 rounds every day. So distance every day she walks is equal to 5 into 196 which is equal to 980 meter. Mathematics question number 42. Mihir buys a house for which he pays 22,500 rupees per month for 48 months. What is the cost of the house? Cost of the house is equal to amount he paid per month into number of months, which is equal to 10,80,000. Everyday mathematics, question number 43. A lampshade P is 230 centimeters long and another lampshade Q is 2 meter 10 centimeter long than lampshade P. Find the total number of length of both the lampshades. Length of lampshade P is equal to 230 centimeter. Length of lampshade Q is equal to 210 centimeter plus 230 centimeter which is equal to 440 centimeter. Length of lampshade P and Q together is equal to 6 meter 70 centimeter. Everyday mathematics question number 44. In a garden, there are 5 square shaped grassy areas each of the, whose side is 8 meters. Find the total area of the grassy park. Area of one square shaped grassy area is equal to 64 square meter. Therefore, area of 5 square shaped grassy area which is equal to 320 square meter. Everyday mathematics question number 45. Priya has to multiply 18.75 by 5. Instead, she multiplied 1.875 by 7. What is the difference between the two answers?
Multiplying 18.75 by 7, we get 131.25. Multiplying 1.875 by 7, we get 13.125. Difference between the two answers is equal to 118.125. That's it for this video. Make sure to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on post notifications so that you guys know most of all the videos that I upload. And I'll see y'all next time. Goodbye.